when I when I first arrived, I mean, there was no hoopla, mm-hmm. you know, and there wasn't this um, situation where um, people were um, standing around and um, aggravated and hostile mm-hmm. and you know, and none of none of those those kinds of things. We are we arrived on campus pretty un unobtrusively, you know. Uh, we, 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 well, I, I take that when I say that. It was, when we got my, my dad's car overheated somewhere near the campus. And so when we drove on campus, um, it was all the smoke billowing out of his, uh, out of his vehicle. And um, so, I mean, <laughs> that was a very embarrassing moment for me personally. I mean, it was a real emergency for my parents. But at any rate, um, some men who were uh, nearby, um, some black men who were nearby, came and helped my dad, you know, with the car. He apparently just needed some water in the radiator. Mm-hmm. Uh, but while he was taking care of that, my mom and I went into Makiva and... Um, and registered, and I don't recall, you know, it was just very calm, I mean, there was no, it was just like anybody else might have gone in to get their registration materials and being directed Mm -hmm. to where they needed to go and and that kind of thing, so, and once we got to the dorm, uh, you know, we were processed through the dorm, told where we needed to go to to, um, uh, unload our things, and Betty was already there, Mm -hmm. she had gotten there uh, earlier that day, and as I recall, we were. This was about two or three o'clock in the afternoon mm-hmm. um, when we got there. But you know, unlike the situation with the uh, in in Alabama with the governor standing in the door and you know blocking the the enrollment of the students, or in Georgia or in some of those other places, there was was none of that. And so that for that, I'm very very grateful. Mm-hmm. Um,